Here they come. They're off. Fox Valley Dakota for the late ideal Cam and Jones Charger. Into the turn they roll on Fox Valley Dakota. He's up on the outside now circling Ideal Cam. And Ideal Cam back to second. It's June's Charger. In third now by three lengths at Gutanic. Fourth by three lengths KT's Cam. A little in that turn by Cam Warrior. Be home early. Trailing the field. That's Cuba Caliente. Your leader is Fox Valley Dakota. Ideal Cam drives out of second. Tries the lead. 28 and four of the first quarter. And it's Fox Valley Dakota with the lead two lengths. It's Ideal Cam. Second by four lengths, June's Charger. Third, three lengths, Echo Tannic. Three lengths back to Katie's Cam. Followed by Cam Warrior Be Home Early. Cuba Caliente. Positions on change and Fox Valley Dakota leads away a length and a quarter. Ideal Cam right there, second, June's Charger. Closing the gap, third, Echo Tannic is out slightly in their halfway home. 58 on three. Now they drive into the clubhouse turn. Fox Valley Dakota leads the way by two lengths. Ideal Cam. He's getting a perfect trip. June's Charger Echo Tannic on the outside of us is Cam Warrior Katie's Cam. Balloon on the outside. Cuba Caliente and be home early. Out of the turn. They curve into the box direction. Fox Valley Dakota leads the way. Ideal Cam. Right there. Second Echo Tannic and third on the outside. Cam Warrior and June's Charger. 129 and 4 for the three quarters. Fox Valley Dakota shows the way into the far turn. Two lengths. Ideal Cam. Right there. Second, it's Echo Tannic. June's Charger at the top of the lane. Fox Valley Dakota. Ideal Cam is ready to come out. Here they come, turning for home. It's Fox Valley Dakota with the lead. Here comes Ideal Cam. Here comes June's Charger charging. June's Charger fastest of all. Number two, June's Charger was first. Number four, Fox Valley Dakota was second. It's a photo for third. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let's check in at Belmoral. Racing fans, we are seven minutes away from tonight's seventh race. This is the Ranchers and McAllister Equipment Race. We have Perfecta and Trifecta wagering on this one-mile pace. Here are your possible pick three payoffs, coupling the fifth and sixth race winners, number six and 11 with the horses in the seventh. One, Kevin's Goal, $618.60. Two, T.A. Michael, $1,148.80. Three, Private Event, $446.60. In the photo, number three, Echo Tonic was third. Number one, Ideal Calm, finished fourth. Moving to the winner's circle, the sixth race winner, number two, June's Charger. June's Charger is owned by the Little Springwood Farms, Diona Modisca, and Santo Lou Tatone of Illinois. Trained by Laverne Hostether and driven by Laverne Hostether. Two minutes flat, and that is a new mark for June's Charger. 2-4 Perfecta returning, $56.60, 60 $56.60. Sixth race top bottom is four one three two six seven five eight on the bottom. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a late scratch in tonight's seventh race. In the seventh race, a late scratch number three, Riley's Comet. Three Riley's Comet is out of the seventh race at Maywood. And ladies and gentlemen, the twin trifecta first half, $23 even. $23 on the first half of the twin trifecta. 